Okay, a while back I uh, noticed uh, while I was washing the truck that the tail light lens is loose. Now it's still tight on the back side where uh, two screws are, but on the outer edge uh, it's uh, moving around. Uh, I'll show you how to fix that. Uh, you can get the parts from your Chrysler dealer, but it takes a while for them to find it. And I'll show you a quick way that uh, I think will last a little bit longer than the uh, plastic clip. Okay, first thing to do, there are uh, two screws here, top and the bottom. This particular truck uses a uh, Torx type uh, wrench. Looks like an Allen, but uh, it's got a little star pattern to it. Go ahead and uh, remove these. Get that out of the way. You can see where this drop, so it's definitely loose. And normally there's a couple spring clips made out of plastic holds these uh, two little uh, ball pins and they're missing. So I'll uh, show you what I did to uh, fix that and replace it. Okay, there's supposed to be uh, two little uh, plastic clips that retain the uh, little ball pins. Get that up here. Got uh, two pins, top and the bottom. They're supposed to be retained by uh, two plastic clips. So they're broke out, so I don't have anything to show you, except for a picture I found online. To get the glare down, uh, should be uh, two of these clips that uh, mount into the holes, and then uh, the pins go into them. So rather than uh, trying to find these clips, I ran down to uh, Lowe's and what I found was uh, a couple of uh, rubber grommets and these things are uh, less than two dollars for a pair of them. The uh, hole measures about a half inch. I couldn't find a half inch grommet but what I found was uh, 27 60 fourths which is uh, pretty close just a hair under and the hard part on this one is to get the grommet in the hole and I found just a little bit of uh, water just get it damp if I get my uh, hand out of the way and see if I can show you. Just squeeze that uh, grommet in. Work it around a little bit. And once you get it in place, that'll uh, Take the spot of that plastic clip down here at the uh, bottom. There's uh, two holes, and that varied according to the type of tail light you had. Uh, the one that's missing for mine is the lower hole, so I'll go ahead and put the other grommet in that one. Yeah, once you get uh, both grommets in, that'll hold these little spring pins. So, once again, you have a little bit of water, maybe some soap, just dampen that up a little bit. You go ahead and uh, press your uh, tail light 
into those rubber grommets. And once you get it, uh, the screws in the side all tightened up, you have very little movement now. So you'll take care of the uh, loose tail light lens. It's, uh, the plastic clips are used by Chrysler for quite a few models. So if you have a loose tail light, uh, cars and trucks, so check out. And if you have a loose part, just uh, maybe consider a rubber grommet to hold that in place. Alright, got everything all tightened up so no more uh, loose tail light lens.